I'm never middle legger. <clears throat> a bottom ladder. And a lot of different area of men, such as financial area, operational area, educational area. Okay? We must distinguish this various kinds of managers. Number four, we will identify the what is the key management skills of successful management in order to be a successful readers, in order to be a successful management that readers must have the distinguished characteristics to read the other people. We must overview, examine these types of readership. <clears throat> Number five, we will discuss a different type of readership, has many readership, after a creative leadership, entrepreneurial leadership, a lot of different types of leadership. Number six, we will discuss the steps in the managerial decision making process. Normally, there are four steps in order to decide the decision for my individual life for my individual business, for our government, for our organizations. There are four steps. We will discuss these four steps. Finally, we will describe how the organizations, how the business, how the campaign benefit from total quality management, TQM. You must learn the total quality management, total quality administrative of the schools. Okay? In order to benefit the school, the school must provide the good rectoring services to the students. That is one of the component of the total quality measurement. Okay, uh, learning objective one, issue one. What is the management? What is the management? Similar is administrative, administration. Similia, meaning the management can be defined as the process of coordinating the people and coordinating the other business resources in order to achieve the goals, in order to achieve the objective of an organization. In order to succeed in your life, in order to be rich in your life, you must coordinate your plans, coordinate your instructors and other resources, institutional fees, reading fees, text fee in order to achieve, in order to attain new high GPA. What is the management resources? There are four kinds of management resources. Four kinds of management resources, business resources, includes material resources, 
human resources, financial resources, information resources. Material resources are the tangible resources, touchable resources, physical resources, an organizations have, an organization can use. Example of material resources is that General Motors uses steel, grass, fiberglasses in order to produce the car, trucks, own machine, driving, assembly lines. Steel, grasses, fiber, grasses are examples of material resources. Human resources is people. <clears throat> Okay, workers, employers, various types of employees, top level people, middle level people, at the bottom level people. Financial resource, what is the financial resource? The financial resource is a money, huge money. Money is required to operate my day-to-day -day business, my day-to-day -day life, my, our day-to-day -day business operations. Money is required. That is the financial resources. Financial resources is the funds, money, an organization can use to meet its obligations to investors and creditors. Example of financial resources. A 7-Eleven convenience store contains the money from custom, from the sage levy. At the checkout counter and uses that uh, portion of the money to pay the salary is employees and to pay, pay the money to the vendors, to the suppliers, financial resources, money, okay? Informational resources. Without the information resources, uh, no business can survive. Without information resources, no individual persons can survive in this striving environments computer a lot of software program okay okay a bigger uh, 6-1 show is the four main resources of management Management coordinating the organizational uh, following for resources in order to achieve the organizational goal. Four resources are material resources, human resources, fin financial resources, informational resources. Coordinated. These are four. Uh, resources in order to achieve the organization goal. The organization goal is uh, uh, <clears throat> to attain a profit, to achieve a profit is the organizational goal. Okay, figure 6-2 shows the management process. Uh, this figure provides the visual framework for uh, discussions of these management functions. There are four management functions. Managers use the following four functions at the same time, simultaneously, in order to achieve the goals of the firm. 
Okay? Four process are planning process, organizing process, reading and motivating process, controlling process. Management is not a step-by-step -step procedure, but management process with a feedback, piece of feedback, loop that represented the floor. Uh, management uh, <clears throat> process, these four uh, functions at the same time, simultaneously, that is the management. Okay, first, a process. Planning a process. Plan. Okay, every individual person, every business must have the plan. Must to set the plan. What is the plan? Plan is to setting the organizational goals. First step, a planning consists of two steps. First step, setting the goal, objective. Second step, how to decide, how to achieve. Decide the method, decide the strategy, decide the tactics. How to achieve that goal is the planning. Okay. Planning is the first function. Mission. A mission can be included in the uh, planning functions. A mission is a statement of basic purposes that makes the organizations different from other organizations is the mission. Every business, every organization has a mission. Example of a mission statement. Land law has a mission statement. The other school has a different mission statement. The other business has a mission uh, statement. Government, federal government, local government, the city government has a different mission statement. <clears throat> Starbucks mission statement is that to inspire the human spirit to nature, the human spirit, one person, one cup of coffee and one neighborhood at a time. That is the Starbucks mission statement. Amazon.com's mission statement is that to be the Earth's most um, <clears throat> customer-centric company where people can find. Japan people can find, Korean people can find, Chinese uh, people can find the Amazon.com through the internet. And every people can discover everything, anything they want to buy the uh, merchandise online. 
That is Amazon.com. Twitter mission statement is to give everyone the power to create the ideas, the power to share the ideas and information instantly without the barriers. Is the Twitter's a mission statement? Okay, uh, there are uh, many types of uh, planning. <clears throat> Strategic planning, <clears throat> tactical planning, operational planning. Okay, first, strategy, planning process. What is the meaning of a strategy? Strategy. A uh, strategy <clears throat> involves normally minimum five years planning period, long term planning is a straight a strategic planning. A strategic a planning process involves establish the organization's major goals and objectives and the uh, allocating the resources to achieve them. The goal. The goal is an end result that an organization is, is expected to achieve over a uh, one year period to a uh, ten year period. Objective is a specific statement uh, detailing what an organization intends to accomplish over a short period of time. Okay? The goals. A different department has a different goals. A different level has a different goals in the organizations that a different goals may complete within the organizations. However, the manager's job is to balance the different goals okay that is called optimizations <clears throat> SWOT analysis let's start with SWOT analysis what is the SWOT analysis SWOT stands for strengths Weakness, opportunities, and threat. SWOT analysis is the identif identifications and evaluations of a firm's strengths, weakness, opportunities, and a threat. Among these four components, strengths and weakness are the internal factors that affect the campaign's capabilities. Strengths. What is my strength? What is my business strength? Strengths refers the firm's favorable characteristics and core competencies. <clears throat> What is your individual strengths? I have a lot of money. That is your strengths. Core competences is approaches and process that a campaign perform well then may give the strengths give 
the campaigner advantages of his competitors uh, against his rival campaigns. Weakness refers to internal or limitations a campaign faces in developing the plan or implementing the plan or carry out my uh, goals. My eyes is poor, is your strength. Opportunity and threat component or slot uh, are the external factors that affect the campaign's capabilities, that affect the individual person's capabilities, opportunities, ripples. A lot of job market is opportunity. For individual persons. Opportunities refers to the favorable conditions in the uh, economic surrounding environments that could benefit the individual persons, benefit the organizations. If individual persons and organizations properly exploited Okay. That is the opportunity. Threat is a barriers, obstacles, conditions that may prevent my uh, the prevent our business, prevent myself from reaching my goal from reaching my firm's objective is a threat, barrier uh, to impede my goal or firm's goal is a threat. There are too many rival uh, campaigns that is a threat. Okay. Uh, this figure shows the elements and examples of, of SWOT analysis. Strengths include efficient distribution channels, employees, education, and the high experience is a strength. Protective patent. My campaign has a protect. Uh, Protective paper is a strength for competencies, excellent facilities, and excellent equipment, uh, proof of management, economics of scale, cost advantage are the strengths of our campaign. Weakness, high turnover, absenteeism, employee higher and fire within a sharp period that is high turnover. Level of strategic directions, absolute production facilities. What is the meaning of absolute? Absolute means the out of passion, all the style, absolute. Labor grievances, lack of managerial Deaths. There is no manager uh, skills negative public image is a weakness. Threat is an entry of a lower cost of foreign competitors. China enter the US market with a lower cost than the threat. Unfavorable change in bias need and taste is the threat. Yeah. Opportunity includes new market is opening up. New technology 
is developed in current years. There are increased demand for new products. There is a potential strategic alliance, more favorable trade regulations in desirable foreign market opportunities. Competitors can play something. This is the uh, opportunities. Okay. Type of plan. Once organizations are set of the goals and the objectives, the managers must develop the plans for achieving the objectives. The plan is the outline of the actions by which an organization intends to accomplish its goals and objectives. Every organization should develop several types of the plan. Tactical plan, strategic plan, okay? Uh, this figure shows the types of uh, uh, plans. Strategic plan, tactical plan, operational plan, contingent plan. What is a strategic plan? Mm. Okay, thanks. Okay. I see this slide in your home. Okay. <sighs> strategic plan. A strategic plan is an organization's broadest plan. It's a leaper as a strategic plan. Broadest plan uh, is span five to 10 years, okay? A strategic plan is developed as a guide for major policies. Setting, policy setting, and decision making, okay? Example, Teresa uh, car campaign. Read this example in your home. Okay, another type of plan, tactical plan. <clears throat> a tactical plan is a smaller scale plan that is developed to implement support to the strategies. Tactics. Tactic plan is normally within one year. Example uh, JC Penny's CEO launched a three year plan to bring in new customers by rolling out appliance to JCPenney stores and website. Operational plan is a type of plan that is designed to carry out a tactical plan. Okay? The uh, top level of plan is a uh, strategic plan, middle level of plan is a tactical plan, at the lowest level of plan is operational plan. Another plan, contingency plan. What is the contingency plan? Contingency plan outline the alternative courses of action, the other alternative course of action that must be taken. Plan. If the, the company, company's other plan are ineffective, are destructive, 
are uh, the, the become the uh, tail. In that case, the alternative plan must be developed and carry out. That is the contagious. Alternative course of action is a contagious. <coughs> What is a contingency of demon? If we want to file a legal lawsuit against your enemy, but you do not have money to hire your attorney, in that case, you must <coughs> uh, <coughs> consult with the attorney and make her contingence agreement with your attorney and you're making a contingence agreement you do not pay the uh, legal fee okay but and your attorney succeed in your legal actions your attorney uh, <coughs> receive the uh, normally maximum of 40% of uh, the your damages okay compensations that is the uh, contingence agreements okay can the other alternative cause of actions the other alternative agreements <sighs> Okay, next, uh, talking, organize the enterprises. What is the organizing? What is the administrating? Organizing is a grouping of resources and activities in order to achieve some end result to achieve some goals in an efficient manner and effective manner. What is the efficient manner? Achieve a goal with the lowest energy. Achieve a goal with no wasting time. That is uh, efficient. What uh, is the meaning of effective? Effective means then to achieve whether to achieve the goal or not. Can achieve a goal effective? Can not achieve a goal? Not effective. Okay, next uh, <clears throat> function is a reading and motivating of functions. But there are four functions in organizations. A reading a function. Reading is a process of influencing the other people, other employee to work hard toward the common goal. My job is to read the students to study harder to achieve the learning objective of this chapter. Motivating. Motivating is the process of providing the reasons why the employee or the other people or the students to work. Okay? The 
essential uh, component or motivating is that uh, provide the reasons for the employee to work in the best interest of the campaign. In the bad work, you must every employee have a legal duty. That legal duty is a uh, <clears throat> loyalty duty. What is the loyalty duty? Loyalty duty means that every employee must have <clears throat> must work in the best interest of the owner, best interest of the principal. Then employee work in the interest of himself or herself. In that case, is that employee can be terminated, fired by the owner because that employee violated the loyal duty. Okay? In the ethics court. <clears throat> The part of man's job is to determine what factors motivate the workers and try to provide these incentives to encourage effective performances. Normally, the uh, <clears throat> board of directors provide that incentive to the minimum. That incentive consists of the stack options. Okay? And the overtime payment is a incentive, a kind of incentive. In order to uh, okay, uh, encourage Effective performance. If, if, what effective performance means that oh the accomplish to obtain the goal is effective. Directing. Directing uh, combine uh, the above functions, reading functions and motivating functions. Okay, uh, directing. Uh, combine the process of reading and motivating. Together, reading and motivating are often called as a directing. What does it mean? Directing equal reading plus motivating. Okay? Mm. <coughs> Contrary. Ongoing activities, contrary day-to-day -day, uh, business uh, activities, contrary the day-to-day -day students' uh, activities. What is the meaning of a contrary? Contrary is the process of evaluating the ongoing activities and process of deregulating the ongoing activities in order to ensure that the goals are achieved. What does it mean? There are three steps in controlling of functions. These three uh, steps is the step-by-step step by step process. First step, setting the standard, setting the goal. Okay, example. Southwest Airlines established the goal of increasing the profit by 12% next year. Second, controlling function. 
is uh, measuring the actual present performance. Measuring the actual these years is a performance. Reserve, major, the actual reserve of the business. Okay. Example, the Southwest <coughs> management will monitor its profit on a monthly basis to ensure the 12% profit. Okay. Therefore, uh, setting the standard uh, is made before uh, the current year. Measuring actual performance are incurred duty from January 1st to December 31st. Normally, at the end of the accounting appear last step take the corrective actions and these corrective actions can be set up the next years setting the standard the next years setting the goal these three uh, steps are repetitive, continuous. Example: After thirty months, Southwest management finds that pro the profit has increased only one percent. Goal is twelve percent, but one quarter's profit is increased only one percent. In the cases, corrective actions. Mm, you'll be needed to get the firms back on the track to obtain the term of person at the end of the accounting period. <coughs> okay, uh, this finger shows the controlling functions. Controlling functions include three steps, setting standard step, measuring actual performance step, and taking corrective action step. Okay. Kinds of manager, kinds of leadership, Kinds of management. The managers can be classified according to their level within the organizations, and managers can be classified according to their area of management. Three general level of management are top level management, middle level management, first line level of management. The area of management is that the organizational structure can be divided into areas of management specializations such as the financial managers, operations managers, marketing managers, human resources managers, administrative managers. Uh, in the school cases, school to service management uh, managers, financial managers, Register management and academy appear managers management and the administrative 
operating manage, management. Okay, uh, this figure shows the management level that is found in most campaigns. Time management, uh, middle man uh, level of management, uh, first line of level management. Okay. Uh, what is the job of each level of management? Time managers is an upper level executive who guide the overall portions of the organizations or who control the overall actions of the businesses. Uh, generally, uh, time manager is responsible for developing the organization's missions and determines the firm's strategies. Uh, common title of time management are president, vice president, chief executive officers, middle level of manager. Job is to implement, to carry out the strategies and carry out the major policies that is developed by time management. Middle managers develop technical plans and develop operational plans. And middle managers coordinate and supervise the activities of first line and managers and the supervise the employees, first of all, employees. Common title of middle managers are divisional managers. <clears throat> LA County managers, branch managers, Orange County, branch managers. Okay? Most of the units are carried out under the name of franchise. Orange County, franchise, manual, is a middle level of management. <clears throat> First line of management coordinate and supervise the activities of operating employees first line manager spend most time working with and motivating the employees answering the questions from the clients answering the questions of the students and solving day-to-day problems Common title of a first line management is office managers, supervisor, foreman of the production department is the first line management. Uh, this figure show the areas of management specializations. <clears throat> the business structures can be also divided into the following areas of management specializations.
financial managers, operations managers, marketing managers, human resources management, administrative managers, and other managers such as research and develop managers. Okay. Who is the financial manager? What is the financial manager's job? Operation manager's job. And what is the marketing manager's job? Financial manager is primarily responsible for the campaign's financial resources, borrowing the money, keep the money, save the money, and pay the salary to the employee. Financial manager's job. Operation manager's job. What is the operations manager's job? To produce good product to produce good services to the customer to provide good lecturing services to the students is the operations managers operation managers manage the system that converted the uh, business resources, material resources into the good and convert the uh, poor type of uh, business resources into the services. That is the responsible, that is the primary job of operational managers. Marketing manager is responsible for facilitating the exchange of products between the companies and its uh, clients or its customers or students, school, between school and uh, students. School is a campaign. What type of campaign? Non-profit campaign. Okay? <clears throat> Human resource managers charged with managing the human resources programs. Hire the employee. Terminating the employee. Send the payment check. <sighs> Register. Human manager, the, the resource manager. Uh, keep the transcript of each student permanently. Okay. The administrative manager is not associated with any type of functional agency. However, administrative management provides the of all administrative guidances and readerships. This figure shows the key skills. In order to be successful management, then management must have at least these following skills. Management 
must have at least analytical skills, conceptual skills, communication skills, written skills, technical skills, interpersonal skills. The management needs to have a variety of skills required Management is required to have a variety of skills, verbal skills, written skills, analytical skills, interpersonal skills, the technical skills. <clears throat> what is a conceptual skill? that the successful management must have. A conceptual skill uh, is defined as the ability to think in the abstract terms. Think in conceptual terms. These conceptual skills allow the management to see the big picture. Uh, think. And see the big picture for the management level. And the manager understand how the various parts of the company or various part how the various part of ideas can bring together, can fit fit together in order to achieve the goal. Uh, example of a conceptual skill. Although uh, Amazon.com is initially operated in the deficit, in the red means the deficit. However, Amazon.com found Jack Bezos never lost the sight of his vision of the internet commerce side where people could ship shopping and buying purchasing quickly and easily through the internet commerce that is the dream of the Amazon.com's found Jeff Bezos and that dreams come true. That is the type of a conceptual skill. Big picture in the absolute terms. Analytic skill. is the ability to identify the problems correctly. Identify the problem correctly. Generating the uh, reasonable alternative and selecting the best alternatives among the various type of alternatives in order to solve the problem solved the campaign is proper. <clears throat> My rational time is limited, therefore. Okay. Uh, please, this example of people 
of the CEO of at home group. Read this example in your home. Okay? <sighs> in the personal scale, in the personal scale, is the ability to deal effectively with other people, both inside the organizations and outside the organizations. Examples of interpersonal skills are the ability to relate it to the people to understand their need and to understand their motives, to understand the customer need and to understand the motives of the employees. This is interpersonal skill and show the genuine uh, compassion. The manager must show his the dream. His genuine uh, compassion to their employees. Technical skill mm, uh, is a specific skill, includes specific skills that is needed to accomplish the specialized the activities. <clears throat> First line manager need to understand the technical skills that is relevant to the activities they manage in order to train his or her subordinate to answer the questions from the client and provide the guidance, even though the managers may not perform the technical task themselves. Okay, that's technical skill, the communication skill. The manager can speak orally, <clears throat> in a very good manner, and uh, in an effective manner. Okay. Communication skill is the ability to speak, to listen, and to write effectively. If you do not have a communication skills, you cannot be a management. You cannot be a pastor. You cannot be a reader. If you do not have uh, communication skills, the managers need both oral communication skills and written communication skills. The oral communication skills are used when a manager make the sales presentations with the PowerPoint, with the Zoom, with the virtual uh, technologies. And communication skills are used and a manager hire the employee and conduct interviews with uh, uh, prospective uh, applicants and hold press conferences. Written communication skill is also important because a manager's ability to prepare the records, ability to prepare the email, memos and prepare the sales report and other written documents 
may spare the difference from and between success and failure. If you do not have, if especially management do not have written communication skills, oh, your company and you and the management can be sued from the other organizations, the other people, from other rival campaigns, competitors. Therefore, management require, is required to have the written communication skills. Very, very important. Or communication skill, written communication skill, very, very important to be a successful manager. Next topic on readership. What is the readership? A readership is the ability to influence other people's. <clears throat> a readership is different from the management. In that, a reader strives. Voluntary corporations, however, manager may depend on the coercion, may depend on the threat to change employees' behavior, okay? Difference, different readership between the, <clears throat> the reader and manager is that reader is a voluntary corporation, manager, <clears throat> course, okay? Different. Okay, a former uh, leadership and informal leadership. Former leaders have restaurant power, restimated authority of positions. Former leaders have the authority, the power within the organizations to influence the other uh, employee to work toward the organizational goal. Okay, internal informal readers usually have no power, have no authority to influence the other people to work toward the organizational goal. The informal readers may or may not exert their influence in support of the organizations. Both formal leaders and informal leaders make use of several kinds of power. Their several kinds of power includes the ability to grant, to provide the reward or impose the punishment or possession of expert knowledge, professional knowledge, and include personal attractions or personal charisma in order to be a leader. That leader must have a charisma to lead the other people, okay? <clears throat> there are three uh, styles of leadership. Autocratic leadership, Participative leadership, entrepreneur leadership. What is autocratic leadership? Mm. Autocratic leadership is a task oriented leadership style, goal oriented leadership style in which the workers 
a whole, what to do, the workers a whole, how to accomplish the objective without having a say in a decision making process. Second style, participate in leadership. In this style, all members of a team are involved in identifying the essential goals and developing strategies to reach those goals. There are three groups of participating leadership, consultative leadership, consensus readership and democratic readerships. <clears throat> Consultative readership discuss the issues with the workers, with the employees, but retain the financial uh, power to decision making. Consultative leader has ultimately the power to decide the decisions. However, consensus readers seek input from almost all employees and make the final decisions based on their all employees per uh, circle. That is a consensus readers. Third group is a democratic readers. Democratic readers gives a final authority provide the final authority to the group, okay? Do not decide he or her himself. Third style of leadership is uh, entrepreneurial leadership. Entrepreneurial leadership is a personality-based leadership. A personality-based leadership style in which the manager seek to inspire the workers, employees with a vision of what can be uh, attained, what can be accomplished to benefit all stakeholders or benefit of all employees or uh, the <coughs> to benefit the <coughs> company, benefit my creditors. Okay, uh, benefit my customers, uh, benefit my employees. Okay, although each entrepreneur is different, uh, this leadership style is generally task oriented leadership, drive leadership, uh, <clears throat> charismatic leadership, and enthusiastic leadership. And to put in order, personality tends to take initiative. Take initiative. Be visionary. Be looking forward in the future. These entrepreneurial readers tend to be invested in their business. Invested all the money into his a visionary a business. <clears throat> Future leadership style is the best. Most management experts agree that there is no best management leadership style. <sighs> because each of these leadership style has the advantages or disadvantages. Therefore, the leadership style are uh, situational according to the environments. 
most effective style involves the balance between interaction among employees, characteristics of work situation, and manager's personality. Manager decision making. Uh, decision making is the action of choosing one alternative from a, a set of variety of alternatives. Okay? Four steps. There are four steps in manager uh, decision making. Okay? Uh, this figure shows the major uh, four steps in the manager decision making process. <clears throat> the managers require a systematic method for solving the problems in a variety of situations. Solve the problem in a variety of surrounding uh, situations. Okay? First step, identifying the problem or identifying the opportunity. Third step, uh, second step, generating the alternative method. Third step, selecting the best alternative method among the variety of alternatives. Fourth step, carry out, implementing the step and evaluating the solutions is the decision making process. First, identify the problem's opportunity. What is the problem? What is the definition of problem? Problem is identify is uh, defined as a uh, discrepancies, discrepancies between the actual conditions, on actual conditions and a desired conditions, discrepancies. The problem may be negative or the positive. A positive problem may be viewed as the op opportunity. A negative problem may be viewed as the threat. This stage of decision making created many uh, difficulties for the managers. Sometimes the managers preconceptions of problems prevent employees from seeing the actual situations. The managers produce the answers must uh, provide the answers before the uh, proper the proper questions has been asked from the student, from the client, from the customers, from the other employees, and manager must read uh, them employees to focus on insufficient issues. Manuals may can be may mistakenly analyze the problems in terms of symptoms rather than the underlying or causes. The effective managers clarify the situations. Examine the causes of the problems and consider 
how individual behaviors and values affect the way problem or opportunities are defined. Second step in generating the alternatives. After a problem has been identified, the next step is to generate the possible alternative method. The certain techniques method can be used to generate the alternative actions, the alternative plans. Such alternative <clears throat> plan includes a brainstorming techniques. Plus, then define techniques. Trial and matter at a method. Braining storming method is a group creative techniques. The breast then defined techniques is developed by the US Navy. In the US Navy, the group members tackle the recurring problems by erasing all pre, uh, pre previous solutions and procedures, erase all previous uh, ineffective solutions, ineffective procedures, and then the evaluate is original objectives and modify the objectives if necessary and then devise a new solution that is the U.S. Navy's invented breast and then define techniques. Third type of technique is a trial and add a method. Trial, trial, multiple attempts are made eventually to reach the final solution is a trial and add a method. Okay? Very tedious, time consuming method. Third step selecting the alternative actions. The final decision is influenced by a number of considerations. This number of considerations include financial constraint. I do not have enough money in order to attend the school, in order to uh, operate the, this business. Okay? That is a financial constraint. Living standard is very high in LA County. Too high or rental payment. Financial constraint, human and informational resources, time limits, legal obstacles. Oh, the uh, under the California state of law, the owner can fire the employees at any time without no notice. Under the California law, that is a legal obstacle. Most business owners, managers, have uh, power. You fire right now. You leave out of my campaign. In that cases, oh, the. Uh, the terminated employee do not have a time to bring uh, the <clears throat> uh, 
take away his the personal belongings, okay? Personal property. Every strict, harsh legal uh, obstacles, political factors, okay? Oh, state government, state a uh, federal government has only to type of the power, exactly to put uh, the federal uh, <clears throat> issue power and the diversity power, except that. Purity state has the power, residual power, political factors. That are political factors. The managers must select the alternative actions. My second alternative action. What is my second alternative actions? My second. What is my second alternative plan? that will be most effective and most practical for my situations. When we have the wrecking time and we have wrecking information, managers often satisfy the alternative method. Satisfy the alternative actions because we do not have enough money, we do not have enough information. Choosing the solution that are only educated, that are only the best, that are only ideal, is not the best. In some cases, the alternative plan, the alternative action can be the best for the individual persons, for the individual businesses. Fourth step, implementing, carrying out and evaluating the solutions. Implementing of a decision requires time, planning, the preparations of a personnel and evaluations of the reserve. If the problem still existed, the management may decide to give the chosen alternatives more time to work and the management the pro if the problem still existed, the managers may adopt the different alternative actions. Or the managers may start the problem identification process or of a game. The manager should be aware of that the failure to evaluate the decisions adequately may have negative consequences. Okay? Okay. Oh, we have space life. Uh, TPM, managing the total quality. Management of quality is high priority in many organizations today. Total quality management, TPM, coordinate, coordinate the efforts. The efforts is directed at improving the customer satisfaction, improving the customer satisfaction or <coughs> uh, the satisfy the customer need is the first job, first goal for the managers and the efforts that is directed at increase the employee 
participations and efforts directed at strengthens supplier, the vendors, partnership, and facilitating the organizational atmosphere of continuous quality improvement, okay, for the effective total quality management, the managers must address the above four components. One tool that is used for total quality management is called as a benchmarking. What is the benchmarking? Benchmarking is a process that is used to evaluate the process, evaluate the products, the management practice of another organization, evaluate the management of, uh, practices of other companies that is superior in some way in order to improve the quality. Basic steps in benchmarking involve identifying the objective, forming the benchmarking team, collecting the idea, analyzing the idea, and acting on the result analysis is the basic step in benchmarking. Although many factors influence the effectiveness of the total quality management program, there are two issues. Two issues are critical in total quality management. First issue, time management must make a strong commitment to the total quality management program by treating quality improvement as a top priority, top set the top priority, set the teaching as a top priority and give the TQM frequent attention. Okay? The management must coordinate the specific elements of a TQM total quality management program so that they work in harmony. They work in co coordination with each other employees, each other workers. Although not all US companies have total quality management programs. The U.S. companies provide many benefits. Their many benefits include the lower, very, very lower operating costs and high return on sales. I say I sold my computer for one hundred dollars, but my cost is the thirty dollars. My net profit is seventy dollars. It means that the high return on my sale revenue, okay, and high return on investment. I invested my money one hundred dollars into my business. However, my uh, the net profit is a. Uh, uh, the seventy dollars. Oh, the my uh, the <clears throat> the return on investment is uh, uh, <clears throat> seventy percent more high uh, return on my investment ROA. Okay, ROI, ROI. Okay, ROA means uh, uh, investment on my uh, asset. Okay, and improve ability to use a uh, uh, premium pricing rather than the competitive uh, pricing, okay? If uh, my product is a very, very unique and 
better good for uh, the my uh, the customers but uh, my product is a uh, average uh, the market price is 100 dollars however my product can be sold 120 dollars okay based on the total quality management program okay Okay, we have limited time. Therefore, uh, I finished. Uh, that's all uh, for uh, today's. Okay, any other answers?